We're ready? We're ready. Hey! Hey, welcome to the Greens. <laughs> Let's bust out some Rivertown Revival stuff. Kellen, the driving force of a revival. It's going to be at Copeland and Diem Petaluma from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. this Saturday. It's a fundraiser for the River Heritage Center on the beautiful McNear Peninsula. Uh, it's to celebrate and conserve our river. Last year, we expected 1,500 people, and I believe there was over 4,000. Yeah, that's correct. Folks in Sonoma County love an all-ages, family-friendly event where fun for the entire family is not an oxymoron. <laughs> there is a special pass you can get. Captain's Quarters, absolutely. Premier river seating in the shade. Beer from Lagunitas Brewing. Delicious wine, some great snacks, and free tarot card readings. Ah. We're so thrilled that yeah. Bug is going to be our water MC this year and he's helping us out and communicating all the fun things that we have going on with our river program. So there'll be an art boat flotilla, boat drag races, We've got a really special art boat coming that's doing a show that I'm not allowed to talk about here on the radio. I mean, you know, there's nothing quite as scintillating as seeing an art boat dressed in drag, so. Totally. Um, <laughs> before we get a tune from some very special guests, uh, Shannon, Stand up here and give us a bit of uh, the lineup. We have about 25 acts ranging from uh, Shovel Man, who's a solo artist. The David Looming Band, the Dirt Floor Band. We have the Hubbub Club. The Swamp Thing, the Jug Town Pirates. Puckle is coming. The Crux. The Smokehouse Gamblers. The Highway Poets. Johnny Hanger, Jimmy James Black, Jack Rune, and Dendell Walker. Jimmy, how are you? I listen to the green scene all the time. Here's Lagunitas, totally involved in yet another fabulous event. And then you're showing up as the Smokehouse Gamblers. Yeah, we seem to try to do it all. <laughs> I, I think we just like to be invited to the party, though, really. Yeah. That's the bottom yeah. line. Well, Lagunitas has been involved in so many um, events. Yes. We got any new beers on the horizon? I think we're going to bring a, our Saison back for this, uh -huh. which is, uh, we made it with organic ingredients this time, so that Ooh, was kind of a, a we like it. Style. There is a dedicated children's area. Chris, you're always so scintillatingly the part. Because that just makes it so much fun for everybody. Yes. You put a costume on, you go to a festival, you're like in, you're like having fun, you want to go out there and dance to these bands that are amazing. This band was awesome. I have a new favorite band now. It's these guys. <laughs> and as far as costuming goes, just think early 1900s, small Petaluma farming community, and they wake up one morning and the carnival is rolled in. So you can come in your straw hat, or your cowboy hat and your overalls, or you can come in your striped socks and your crinolines and your top hat or bowler. And if you just get top the bowler hat. hat on and come on by, it's all right. Remember, July 30th, 2011, 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. The River Heritage Center, it's easy to find. Fourth and Copeland. If you find the drawbridge, you'll be good to go. It's just a heck of a cool place to hang out. There's nine acres there, folks. And shady areas, don't forget, VIP quarters. Um, get your tickets now. It probably will get sold out when everybody starts thinking about what you're doing. Yeah, come on out. Ride your bike. Join the fun. It's going to be Actually, a great no. party. RivertownRevival.com. All right. <laughs> Town Revival, Petaluma, July 30th. 